Well, we're getting still some more images coming in from Orchard Park, New York, just off of Lake Erie and parts off of Lake Ontario, where they saw that really big lake effect snow enhancement through the weekend, especially into your Friday and Saturday. This is where some totals continue to, continuing to climb for some of these spots like Hamburg, 81.2 inches. Now the snow has faded off. Now dry conditions, even some sunshine popping through, but we are going Going to need an extended amount of time of dry conditions as well as sunshine and temperatures above freezing to do some of this melting over six and a half feet from Orchard Park where the bills play so many impacts this video coming in where you can see some of the plows piling that on that's where we continue to see those snow piles get higher and higher and new this afternoon we just learned that the snowstorm in western New York killed three people and led to hundreds of rescues. Parts of the region are still digging out after a deadly lake effect snowstorm dumped this massive amount of snow. And you can see in Orchard Park those plows filling in that. And we have video in. That's the video we're showing you from Erie County DPW snow in Orchard Park. The snow hill is so large that they're starting a second one. Fox's Madison Scarpino joins us live with more on the fallout from the storm in New in Hamburg, New York. Hey, Madison. Hi, Bridget. Just to see the snow piled up over five and six feet has been really surreal. And we're in one of the worst hit areas right now. I don't know if you can tell, but the wind is really picking up here, starting to get very chilly. But as for the snow, looks like that might be over for a bit, but we actually saw some people out shoveling their driveway, their car. So of course we had to talk to them. I am here with my new friend, John. John, first, I got to ask you, are you from this area? Are you used to this type of snow? Yeah, I grew up in Angola for a number of years and I was in Blaisdell for a while. So something like this isn't new. You know, the 06 storm, the 2014 storm, same Buffalo as always. Not your first rodeo. But tell me, I, again, I saw you shoveling. What challenges did you face this time around with this storm? And do you think that it was any worse than those um, past extreme storms or kind of the same? Same as always. You know, uh, you get the heavier stuff on bottom. You got to break up, but the light stuff stays on top. So you just got to pull that off and break up the lower stuff. Yeah, nothing too crazy. When you were shoveling out your cars over there, like we saw, was it pretty difficult? I mean, this snow's really, really thick and sturdy. So just, was it a challenge more than just your typical snowfall? I mean, yeah, with this stuff, you got to break it up and you're usually carrying chunks more than you are shovelfuls of snow. So, and you know, I got to ask you, do you like this kind of weather and, and what's next for you? Did you get everything cleared away? Are you worried that it's going to pile up more? I mean, it's the same Buffalo as always, you know, the storms come, they go uh, next. I mean, got my car dug out, got to dig out my neighbors. That's about it. With that being said, last thing I want to ask you, it's it's so great to see this community really just kind of rally around each other. And everyone that we've talked to has actually been in great spirits through this storm. Can you speak at all on just the, the community help and, and people helping their neighbors during a time like this? Yeah, there's always people with shovels and snowblowers more than welcome to shovel your driveway for a beer and a little bit of money, you know? Well, I love that so much. Thank you so much for your time, John. We really appreciate it. We got to say that President Biden did declare a federal emergency for Erie County, which includes Hamburg. So crews are going to come out here and help cover the cost of cleanup from this monster storm. I'll send it back to you, Bridget. Crazy stuff, Madison. I think if anyone deserves their Thanksgiving meal, extra potatoes, extra dessert, it's the people in western New York. Really crazy to see all of that and all of the shoveling yes, involved. Do. Fox's Madison Scarpino. Thank you. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.